Yeah, we have some new developments tonight. In the case of a teenager gunned down on the streets of New Haven, he was shot and killed last year, and now his alleged murderer is facing a judge. News is Jason Newton talked to the teenager's mother after she faced that accused killer in court today. Hard, very hard to have someone that killed your son walk past you. Lisa Craggett sat inside a New Haven courtroom Tuesday, watching as the man accused of killing her 15-year-old son was arraigned. 37-year-old Lance Edwards was formally arrested and charged for the murder. Ain't nothing I can do and no one else can do that can beat the wrath of God. So I'm going to let God handle that. It was a triple shooting back in August in New Haven's Hill neighborhood. Craggett's brother and another man were injured inside a vehicle at the intersection of Vernon and Davenport. But 15-year-old Jacob Craggett was killed by the hail of gunfire. Craggett was also a cousin of a New Haven police detective. We take these cases very personally, and this case touched us a little closer to home because it affected one of our own. Edwards was already behind bars on an unrelated charge. He has a long criminal history dating back almost 20 years, including 15 prior convictions, several for assault. The J and Joy brings justice. The J is for justice also. I want justice for my son. I want justice for my son that was shot five times. I want justice for my nephew who was horrified in that car. Bond was set for Edwards at $2 million. Craggett's mother says that the accused killer is somebody who she's known for a long time, and she believes he's feeling remorse. He knows us. He's known us for years. So he's being tormented. In New Haven, Jason Newton, News 8.